Hi everyone, in this video I will be unboxing the Xiaomi Akara door and window sensor and showing you how to pair it with the Samsung SmartThings hub and how you can do a, for example, a light automation with it. So let's jump in. This is the Xiaomi Akara door and window sensor. It's a Zigbee device so I can connect it to my Samsung SmartThings with a custom device handler. It's powered by a coin cell battery and it's rated for minus 10 to plus 50 degrees Celsius. So there's some two-sided tape for fixing this on the window or a door. It seems this is just an empty box has some instructions with it. So this is the sensor unit with the battery in it. This is essentially a magnet to indicate to the sensor is it closed or open or closed. So I bought this for around 11 US dollars. So it is somewhat cheaper than the Samsung SmartThings sensor, which I think you can get for around $20. So it has the battery pre-installed and it does have the two-sided tape already on the device so this is just a spare there is a small indicator light here and this is the button which you use for pairing now i have added a custom device handler in my samsung smart things hub i will leave a card up there and a link down in the description to my video on how to add custom device handlers and I'll leave the GitHub co co code link for the custom device handler also down in the description so you can follow the instructions on, on how to do that step. So next I will pair the device to my Samsung SmartThings hub. I'll go to add a thing and then I'll press on the button. Okay, so now it has found my Xiaomi Akara door sensor. I'm going to save it. Confirm paired devices. You successfully paired one device. We'll configure them so you can start using them right away. Okay. Okay, so the instructions say that you need to align these two lines here so that it gets closed and it said uh, it's 22 millimeters you can hold them apart so something like this but then it should yeah now it says it's open now it's closed and the specifications for the device say that it's uh, for indoor use there is no water protection on the device and it's uh, temperature rated for minus 10 to plus 50 degrees. Okay, here it says that the battery would be at 100%. This uh, Xiaomi Akara sensor model doesn't have a temperature sensor in it and it doesn't either have um, a sensor for vibration so if somebody knocks on the door it will not sense that. So it's, it's a very basic model with only this open and close functionality. There's really very little settings on the device. There's a, a battery change date and some settings for the voltage level for, for sensing when the battery needs to be changed. So next, let's create an automation in Samsung SmartThings with this new door sensor. So the goal is to automate my outdoor lights to go on when the door opens. So let's go to automation and smart lighting and new lighting automation. Which device do you want to control? So I'll control the virtual sun of outdoor light switch, which in turn will control my outdoor lights. What do you want to do? Turn on. How do you want to trigger the action? So I want to use the open or close. Which open close sensor do you want to use? Okay, so I'm using the Xiaomi Akara door sensor. Turn on when opened, turn off when closed. 
after this many minutes I'm going to set two minutes more options only during certain times so I'll put this between sunrise and sunset but just to demonstrate this I'll, I'll not uh, set that now okay so that's it and it's saved I have my door switch here I will of course fix it on the door after this when I open the door switch the lights are turning on and the lights will turn off after two minutes please give a thumbs up if you found this video helpful and also consider subscribing for other similar content later on i have a lot of uh, home automation videos coming up so hope to see you in the next one bye for now